Today we're going to enter new patient information. When you start the system, ultimately the software will bring you to the patient information screen and to enter in new patient information you can just select from the menu on the right hand side of the screen the very top selection of new patient which corresponds to the gray triangle on your control panel. Once you do that the highlight for the patient ID number appears in yellow on the left half of the screen. At this point you just need to enter in the patient's ID number and then press enter and the highlight will then move to the next cell for the patient's last name. Type in the last name, press enter and then enter in the first name. Now this is the minimum required information. Everything else that you see pop up on the screen once the first name is entered is optional. All right. At this point you can put in a middle initial or you can select the sex of the patient either by clicking the little pull down menu and selecting from that or typing either M or F for that particular cell. All right. Entering patient's birth date has to be done in the two digits for the month and the day and four digits for the year. The hand dominance can be selected from right click, a right click menu, and you can select either right or left or no handedness if that's what's desired. Push the begin testing button to start this visit. All right. Once the basic patient information has been entered, you might choose to enter some additional information that is pertinent to today's visit. To do this, just press the gray triangle button. From the screen that appears, you can enter in additional information, for the most part, through a series of right clicks. Under Examining Physician, you can just right click this field and a small pop-up window appears where you can select the physician name. Same thing is also true for the referring physician. Again, right click and you have another choice of names. For skin temperature, right click and a pre-measured skin temperature can then be entered. Medications, there is a list of drugs that you can select from. If the drugs that are necessary to be entered here, and if they don't appear, then you can hand type them in. The field for height must be entered by typing. And it would be in this case maybe five feet. Uh, 10 inches. Now in the field for referring, referred for, right click and you can actually build a small paragraph of text based on a series of choices. Also if you want to you can hand type into this field to enter in information that is not displayed here. All right. And the same is also true for medical history. Again, you, have, you can build a short paragraph of information based on a list of possible problems that they might have. And when you have completed this, you can just click the Done button to close this window down. And then you save your changes.